six-game lead over the Twins. The Athletics were in Cleveland's big ball yard on this all-too-glorious 4th of July. A's here are down 1-0 in the fourth. Ron Hassey with a drive. Watch Corey Snyder. Yeah, he's got it. To save a run into the fifth inning. Carney Lansford at the plate coming out of the slump. Oh, yeah. Single to center. Glenn Hubbard's got the green light. Joe Carter with the throw. Andy Allenson, six feet, five inches tall, gets bowled over by the little guy. Step on the plate. Yeah, now you're safe with the game's tied at one apiece. The Indians trailing two to one, but Carter here singles up the middle. Andy Allenson coming around. He will score because Henderson's got some problems here. And we're safe at second. It's 2-2 into extra innings. Controversy in the 11th. Corey Snyder looks like the game is over. Looks like, you can't tell from this angle, but might have should have been a home run. Tim Tashita says it was a foul ball. Johnny Girl, the coach, got ejected. Doc Edwards starting to get heated up in the 12th. Julio Franco takes exception at strike three. He gets cost by Ted Hendry for arguing strike three. Corey Snyder would get ejected, and Doc Edwards would get tossed. Doc wanted to get his money's worth. On the way to the clubhouse, does his Mike Tyson impersonation. And here in the 16th inning. You know, Mark McGuire did this yesterday in Toronto. Today, in the 16th inning in Cleveland, the second straight day. He wins the game in the 16th with a home run and a 4-2 victory for Oakland. Carney Lanford is now 8-for-15 coming out of a slump. The A's this year in extra innings are 9-2. Past the 13th inning, they are 7-0.